What's going on, fam? I'm Jada Black here. I want to talk about this adult star by the name of Tiana Trump, okay? Apparently, she sent out a tweet that went viral. She's going viral once before, but I'm going to speak about this first. Where she tweeted the Oklahoma City Thunder's Twitter page and says, your player needs to pay me what he owes me. Now, people are looking at the OKC Thunder it's basically a brand new roster. They gotten they gotten rid of a lot of their pieces over the years that have helped build up that organization. And some people think that it's Paul George because she spoke in an interview and said that when she was 16, because she's 23 now, when she was 16, she got with an Indiana Pacer. And people was assuming that it was Paul George. Because Paul George like his slores. Let me make other players you could have been with. But then she's talking about OKC Thunder. And being that she probably doesn't watch sports like that, she's only one of these casuals, she probably doesn't even know the guy doesn't even play for the team anymore. Okay? <laughs> she probably thinks he's still on the OKC roster. And also, it looks like she deleted the tweet because someone liked the tweet. They went to look up the tweet. And I guess they couldn't comment on it. And when you can't comment on a tweet, it probably means the person's removed it. And I think that's what happened in this case. So apparently somebody must have paid her off. Listen, when you have these situations with females like this, okay, who make a living by getting attention, who make a living by getting with people on, on film. Now she seems to just, you know, be very thotty on Instagram you know, her and um, Brittany Renner are very cool with each other. As a matter of fact, they actually look like sisters. They have the same body type. They kind of look very similar to each other. Not too much, but just physically, body-wise, they look basically the same. And, you know, birds of a feather, <laughs> they get together, Okay. Now, listen, I, I don't care how she lives her life. She can live her life doing whatever it is that she wants to do. But when you're tweeting the Oklahoma City Thunder official Twitter page to settle some debt you have with a guy who paid you to fly out on credit, you need to deal with that with that person and not bring the Oklahoma City Thunder into it because they have nothing to do with it. And these chicks do that because they know they're going to get attention and maybe she was serious about that but this is why you shouldn't be flying out on credit getting with these dudes thinking that they're going to pay you this exorbitant amount of money they claim they were going to pay you which is probably what happened you know she got flown out by the putting a nice hotel dude probably said well you know i'll give you this you know if you come out i won't be able to do it this while you're here but i will do that soon and she agreed to it you know because just flying a chick out will get her you know feeling herself you know so i think that in this situation man it just shows you that you got chicks like her man that they're gonna do whatever they can to get to, to galvanize attention from people man even tweeting the oklahoma city thunder in order to settle some quote-unquote debt you have with a guy who flew you out and didn't pay you on that day you know uh, it, it just shows you where we are, man. And again, people can do whatever they want in their personal lives. I'm not one of these people that's going to tell people what to do with their personal business. Uh, but when you look at chicks like her and Brittany Renner, who wrote, who wrote a whole book on, you know, the type of guys that she was getting with. Okay. Total invasion of privacy. I, I think that you see where we are in society that you have females who are looking for whatever come up they can get and they're willing okay they're willing to write books they're willing to do interviews they're willing to put you on blast even though you don't see too many uh athletes or rappers getting put on blast anymore i think these guys have smartened up but a year a year ago oh man but now i think a lot of guys are smartening up they're being very careful about how they deal with females and that's a good thing uh, because it, it lessens the amount of clout that these particular individuals get, you know, and I, I think that's actually a good thing because 
We got too many clout chasers going around as is. We don't need any more clout chasers. We really don't. We we're. I think I think we we have enough clout chasers to last us a lifetime. Okay.